Hi guys! Welcome to Snore's Kitchen. I am Rachel and I am Snore's wife. And today, we're gonna be making some breakfast waffles. What up? This is Snore's Kitchen. So baby, tell me how you made your waffles. Okay, so basically, I just um, followed the recipe or like the instructions from a uh, from the snow kwame um, waffle and pancake mix so for this recipe um i'm just gonna be making five waffles so i made sure that um i did my math and did the ratio and stuff so i won't go overboard so um this is composed of two thirds of the flour uh, a half cup of uh, water one tablespoon of uh, vegetable oil and then i asked snore earlier if he wanted a Cheese waffles, and then yeah, he said yes. So I'm yes. Adding this to the mix, it's a Mexican blend cheese. Yes. Okay, cheese. Then, uh, also, um, I think a few days ago, um, Snore also made some garlic butter, so we're gonna be using them later. Yay. So let's get started. So here's the batter. I made sure that I don't overmix, otherwise it's gonna be really tough. So once you get all the dry ingredients wet, that's about it. And then here's the waffle maker. You have to make sure that the waf uh, waffle maker is preheated first. Yeah, so yeah, make sure that your waffle maker is preheated first, just like any other, you know, cooking stuff, pans, I guess. And then Oh no, I think I was the only making one waffle, but it's alright. One waffle. Sorry, I lied. No, we'll split it. Yeah. Okay, That's then. the last of the mix, though. Yeah, it's the last of the mix. Oh, it's the last of the mix. Oh, we'll toast some bread. We'll make some toast. Toast! Well, the recipe told me to toast to make um, five waffles. So. Huh. Oh, oh, now I know. Sorry. I over... I overfilled. So I guess that's the thing you should watch out for. Overfilling. Yeah, so you can see it kind of drips from here. No, it'll be fine. Yeah, but it'll be, yeah. It's not too bad, I think. Yeah, it's not too bad. It didn't look like it was too overfilled, but anyway. So yeah, and then the waiting time is until when this light indicator over here goes off. Oh. So baby, tell us about yourself. Oh, so um, my real name is Rachel Alleluia. Um, I am a nurse, just like Snore. And then, um, what else? Oh, um, I'm not really into cooking un unless the food is like something I really, really like. Like, I know how to cook some stuff. Steak, probably. Steak. And then, um, shrimp. And then, yeah. Shrimp. Um, yeah, basically, I only cook stuff that I really like. So I don't bother um, looking for other recipes. I'm not as adventurous as Norris, so, yeah. Mm, thank you. <laughs> Let's wait for the waffles. Yeah, it should be. It should take um, around three to four minutes. But then, if you really want your waffles toasted, you know, I mean, some people have their preferences. For me, I like it a little bit toasted on the sides, so you can leave it um, more than um, more than I guess more than the time it takes for the light to go off. So, but right now, it smells really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We should buy more waffle mix. We should try other brands. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. We should try other waffle mixes. We should use the waffle maker. <gasps> um. At this point, you can actually check if. The um the waffles are the right um, yeah so you can check the waffles if you think like um is the right 
Oh, you okay? Yeah. But, oh. yeah, it seems like it's science on. <laughs> so, I guess, yeah, from this experience, just make sure the steam don't burn you. It burns. But, no, no, no go, go wash but it with water. Okay. I mean, no, wash it with water, Kaga, like cold water. It's not, yeah, yeah. Okay. Sorry. But it doesn't hurt anyone, so. Yeah, it just helps. I think, um, the amount of cooking depends on how much batter you put. Well, it's common sense, but it's still steaming, so probably there's still some wet um, surfaces. Well, right now, it's like seven minutes in video, so uh, it hasn't been like five minutes yet, so yeah, so the maximum waffle is seven or five minutes, seguro. Oh, it looks better, I think. Oh. It's fine, okay. I guess I should use my left. There you go. So that's Ooh. about the right color for me, at least. Looks good, right? And then, yeah. So this is what I was talking about. I should have not filled until this edge, but then the crispy edges are the best. So. Crispy edges! It looks bigger than your head though. Yeah. I swear, yeah, it looks bigger than your head. Oops. Oh! Trend. Trend. There you have it. It looks a little bit burned, but that's the way I like it. No, it's perfect. Oh, okay. So, yeah, there you have it. And then next is for you to smother it with um, garlic butter or like, well, any butter. Mm -hmm. So for us, it's garlic. Garlic. I want to make sure I get all those quadrants. Mm -hmm. Then it's just gonna melt right off. Do you want to microwave that again, Nella? Or I guess this it's one? gonna melt right off, yeah. Yeah, or yeah, I can do that, but yeah. Just microwave it. Yeah. Yeah, it'll be fine. But let those let those things melt. Okay. Yeah. You know what we should do next time? Chicken and waffles. Chicken. We have chicken. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's not a good thing. So there you have it. Okay, so there you have it. This is the finished product of our breakfast waffles. Thanks for watching. And then don't forget to hit like and subscribe down below. See ya!